it's rude. What you're doing? It's always role playing, Stephanie. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Hi, Stephanie's happy, big in that. happy indictment week. Hi, hiya. Hi, hi. Wow, it's like it never ends indictment <laughs> week, just... except except unlike infrastructure week, things actually happen. Yes, exactly. they actually are building indictments, mm-hmm. and they will come. Um, rude. Uh, you I, interesting couple of tweets. You said oh, we're going to slide into civil war in this country because the Biden administration is worried about looking too political by stopping it now. Um, I would ask you. It, what are they supposed to do? <laughs> I mean, you your follow-up was it's hyperbole to make a point uh, that there's so much criminality on the right and they should all be rounded up and held until trial, but Biden doesn't because, well, I said why. Well, I mean, the other thing is that it, there actually is independence between the DOJ and the White House. So this is what Trump is trying to do now is Biden's doing this and Biden's doing that yeah. and Biden's, you know, prosecuting me. It, when it, Doesn't that play right into that if you, you, you know, you're saying, I mean, I, I'm well, just asking how would Biden try to stop this i mean i mean you know and by and i by biden i mean the biden administration which right. also means the independent thing i mean i don't understand why for instance there's no uh special counsel investigating jared kushner's deal yeah right uh, yeah I, you know there are just things like that that i'm like yeah. why are we not why yeah. are we not pursuing this yeah Maybe i just said don't. god bless jamie raskin for at least right. bringing it up and putting it forward but you're right you know you and this isn't just revenge that there was actual criminality there. I mean, there was right. I, billions and billions changed hands at the Trump family's, uh, what do you call it, uh, benefit. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and Raskin's going to put out that that report on how much they made. Um, but, you know, and it's also the elevation of the Hunter Biden case. That is solely something that is coming from the fevered swamps of the yeah. right-wing media. Yeah. I mean, it's anything it is just minor minor stuff that he is being charged with yeah and it you know it could still very well be over this could all just be a show yeah to, uh to, you know to to get to that deal again but um but yeah so but this I is just this is how... feel like they, they march to the beat of the right wing media yeah and nothing he does is going to satisfy them right like that's no, the problem no, is that the there's thing. they're you... going to say civil war if he goes free right. yeah yeah. By the way, you said uh, I've often said if civil war would last ten seconds until Skeeter saw Jesse Ray get his face blown off by a sharpshooter a thousand yards away. <laughs> oh yeah, Jesse Je- Skeeter would jump on his scooter and throw his rifle aside and just wheel on out well, of there. Did you see this lunatic that was shot but to death by the FBI for threatening the president and Alvin yeah. Bragg and whatever? His family defended him like, oh, he's just a good God fearing American. He's o- o- obese and elderly and stays and lives at home. It's like, well, OK, but then don't have 6000 rounds of ammunition and right, guns right. and threaten the president and the FBI. I mean, it's like, right. Well, yeah, you can be obese and elderly and still shoot a gun. I mean, right. In fact, you know, with the kind of guns they have, you can fire a lot of bullets very quickly. Yeah. By the way, you uh, we just were talking off air, but you said you tweeted, I honestly think if Kennedy ran as a Republican, he'd be giving Trump a run for his money because crazy attracts crazy. And we were just saying he said, did you see this weekend? He said he would sign a ban on abortion after three months if he's president. I'm like, what in what world are you a liberal still? Like, he later rescinded that. His uh, campaign put out something okay. saying saying that that's not that, that he fully supports a woman's right, uh, a right to choose. Um, mm-hmm. So they they did walk that part back. Yes, but you know it's also that as long as she's yeah, not vaccinated, is that <laughs> right? 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 Yeah. Get that is as long as you don't vaccinate the fetus. Um, <laughs> You're, uh, but but that's the thing is like he's he's got that that it's the reason why Trump I've always said Trump won is the name recognition yeah. and the stupidity of of those voters saying well he's famous he for for this yeah. he must be good yeah and it's wanting thing, chaos you know that, yeah w- it's wanting to blow thing. up the whole system that whole you know yeah 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 um, so yeah why not yeah. run as a Republican let's see what happens. Yep. You ran uh, a great piece, uh, which basically is about the uh, Wheel yes. Of right wing hypocrites. Now, I thought I would be too old to know about this, but I did know about this guy. <laughs> Why didn't the right defend uh, Kai Senate's actions on uh, on free speech? So he's the guy. So he's gonna. He's whatever he is. Whatever those people are. Remember, we had Glozell, and she yeah. uh, is like a billionaire because she eats stuff on. YouTube. I don't know. Yeah, she rang the bell streamer. at the stock exchange because she, I don't know, eats nasty stuff. Anyway, <laughs> it's one of those kids. Yeah, when I, my day, you used to have to have a show, like the Carol Burnett show and some talent. 
These damn kids. Anyway, Quit he, I don't know. Streamer. <laughs> a, a, a streamer. He's a Twitcher, Twitch. a streamer, or something, and he was sitting gonna... Yeah, Twitch streamer, which just sounds like, you know, having a bad urination. <laughs> yeah. But... Yes, a need to go. That, that, yeah. The, the f- commercial with all the old guys fishing. Um, <laughs> there are a bunch do you of have Twitch a Twitch stream? <laughs> But he was said he was going to give out a bunch of PlayStations and caused a yeah. you know riot in uh, Manhattan, blah blah blah. But yeah, you're right. There, uh, we've long since given up. Of course, right. there's no consistency. All they mean is the the law does not apply to Donald Trump. Right. Period. Exactly. So all of the points you make, which are great about inciting violence, and but you know Trump is of course you know blameless uh, in right wing yeah. circles for anything, right? Right, right. Or it's all just free speech. It's all just free speech if you if you tell people to go march on the Capitol. And uh, and fight like hell, um, or we're going to lose our country. Yeah, yeah. Chris. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. Here we go. <laughs> Touch you off guard, didn't Okay. No, we're good. Who said he's a criminal defendant? He's going to have restrictions like every other single uh, single other uh, defendant. Who said that? Dinky dog. No, Judge Chutkin. Oh. Um, <laughs> Hmm. I know the answer. Caitlin Collins said, while debating whether Trump can review evidence in the J6 case on his own without attorneys present, baby needs minders. Yeah. yeah. Uh, prosecutors raised concern about Trump taking notes or making copies of documents, saying he's shown a desire to hold on to material that he knows he shouldn't have. <laughs> right, baby? Right, baby? Okay. <laughs> um, rude. My question is, what do you think Judge Chutkin is, is or is not going to do? about these latest inflammatory statements this weekend, which she specifically said on Friday, don't do. Is she going to wait till August 28th? Obviously, she's threatened to move up the trial. Uh, What what do you think she does and when? Well, I mean, this morning, uh, while you're on the air, Trump uh, essentially told Jeff Duncan, the lieutenant governor of Georgia, Mm -hmm. that... He shouldn't be testified. Oh, right. so he, that, oh hello. That's, Hold your calls. We have witness tampering. tampering. Yep. <laughs> that's, he says, uh, I am reading reports that failed former Lieutenant Governor Georgia Jeff wow. Duncan will be testified. Don't we all just sort of instinctively know Trump voice now? Uh-huh. Yes. He'll be testifying before the Fulton Grand County Grand Jury. He shouldn't. I barely know him, but he was, right from the beginning of this witch hunt, a nasty disaster. I love that. A nasty disaster. nasty disaster. For those looking into the election fraud that took place in Georgia. He refused to have a special session to find out what went on, became very unpopular with Republicans. I refused to endorse him and fought the truth all the way. Wow. So he's there intimidating a witness. Yeah. Oh my That was my first thing. morning show and my first garage band, Nasty Disaster. Nasty all right. Disaster. No, it was <laughs> the lobster band. We all know that. <laughs> That that just sounds like Paul Lynn. Oh, what a nasty disaster! That's nasty. <laughs> um, Sorry, that's for the olds. That's a joke. That's yeah. the olds. <laughs> I was, I was in love with Paul Lynn, so I know, right? I just, no gaydar, even then. <laughs> Sorry. Um, so, yeah, I, I mean, and you're right. We all knew he's going to do it. Like, even yeah. when they asked him at the Iowa Fair, are you going to abide by the protective, you know, I, I, I don't know, fake, it's all fake. Right, and then they said, "Are you going to take a plea deal?" That's a wise guy question. It's a wise guy question. We didn't pick a plea deal. We did nothing wrong. Yeah, yeah. 